I stayed up till about 3 a.m. last night. I got just past, the, just where I got to the uh, the blue ooze or blue goo in Portal 2. Because I figured that I, I had no right to go on a tour of Valve without having played a single Valve game. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to try to find my sweater. I don't know where it is. But then I realized, wait a second, I'll just buy a Valve sweater when I get there. How do you know that they have a gift shop? Every major game studio I've been to has a gift shop. It's 7 a.m. We normally don't get this early, but today's a special day because we're going up to Seattle for one day. We're flying up and flying right back because we're visiting Valve Software. Woo! Yay. <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> yeah. So this time we're not flying U.S. Airways. <laughs> we're flying our favorite airline. <laughs> the airline of the future. Virgin. So this is the Valve Lobby. This is their Valve, or spinny red thing. Sweet logo. I think they have more stuff. Oh, we got case mods, it's cool. We just got out of Valve's offices and they hooked us up with an insane amount of swag. More swag than we've ever gotten in one location. And also, sorry Google, they got way better fridges than you guys do. Not only do we get swag for ourselves, but we picked up picked up women's swag for our girlfriends who we uh, ditched today to come up here. It's a fantastically huge, heavy model, which I don't think you can buy anywhere. You can only get anymore, it from Valve yeah. himself, so that's incredible. Good work, Matt. The worst class, but... Thanks very much, Valve. Yes. Um, <laughs> sorry nobody came and saw your booth at E3.